What's good, sports fans? It's your boy Damian Adams from The Real Deal with Damian Adams and Third and Three Podcast. Go ahead and subscribe to both of those podcasts wherever you listen to podcasts. Now, today I wanted to come to you with a question. Have we allowed athletes to get away with too much with the money that they make nowadays? Now, the reason I ask this question is that recently we had a trade between the 76ers and the Brooklyn Nets where the 76ers acquired James Harden, the Brooklyn Nets acquired Ben Simmons along with other players. And the reason that both of these players wanted to get traded is that they were unhappy in their situations. James Harden is a little unsure, it's not as concrete why he was unhappy. It could be Steve Nash's coaching style. It could be his relationship with Kyrie Irving for reports. We don't know, but he wanted out. This is the second time in two years that he wanted out of a situation and got his wish. Ben Simmons, we all know that he performed, you know, just not up to standard in the playoffs last year. Fans were very critical of him. Players, coaches were very critical of him. It affected his mental health per reports. And he was no longer playing for Philly. And he made every excuse in the book. It was his back. Mentally, he wasn't ready. We just know he didn't want to play for Philly. So he got his wish as well. And for the money that they make, shouldn't they be able to make the best out of a situation? Unless it's just something that you can't make the best out of is a horrible organization like the Detroit Lions, for example, or even my New Orleans Pelicans hasn't been a good situation for players to be in. I get those situations and want it out. But when you're with a team like Philadelphia, who's been a contender these past few years, they were number one seed in the Eastern Conference last year. And because you performed badly and lost a series against Atlanta that you should not have lost, and fans are critical of you, you want out. You don't get along with the other star player. You want out. James Harden. Houston gave him everything he wanted throughout his tenure there. He gets to a situation now where they seem like they're not going to be a contender. He wants out. Gets to Brooklyn with Kyrie, with KD. And they go through some tough times because of injuries and Kyrie's vaccination status. He wants out. And with the money that they make, shouldn't they be able to make the best out of those situations, especially if they're on good teams? We know Brooklyn, if James Harden, KD are healthy, Kyrie only playing half the games, I get that's rough. But those guys are contenders for championships each and every year. Philadelphia is playing well this year without Ben Simmons. Imagine if Ben Simmons was there, how good they would be. They were number one seed last year. So it's not like these guys are in losing situations where you're like, okay, I understand. They're in situations where they're like, oh, I just don't like it here. And I'm always going to be pro athlete. I think that athletes should make as much as they can while they can because the money that they generate for the networks, the ESPNs, the NFL networks, the NBA networks, TNT, CBS, NBC, all those guys is astronomical. The money they make for the owners of the teams, astronomical. So athletes should get as much as they can. I'm always going to be pro athlete when it comes to the money. But with the money that they're making now, you should be able to take care and deal with some inconveniences that come with your job. There's a lot of people now who making $18, $20 an hour right now at a meeting that could have been an email. You're making $25, $30 million a year and you just want out because you don't get along with one of your teammates? You don't like the coach? Has it gone too far is my question. And if you want my opinion on the trade itself, I wrote an article on 3rdandthreepodcast.com. Go ahead and check that out on the Ben Simmons and James Harden trade. But am I tripping? Am I going too far in criticizing these players? Please let me know.